JBN, we keep you informed. I'm Michelle Jones and in the news, Portmore pastor shot near his home dies. Please remember to subscribe, share, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items. Hallelujah. Good morning. Good morning, my brothers and sisters. Song says we pray and God delivers. We pray and God stopped the war we pray and god delivers yes god gave us one more chance blessed 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 monday morning what a day to be alive praise god linville lewis the pastor of the spanish town tabernacle and greater portmore tabernacle who was shot several times near his portmore home on monday has died he was attacked just after midday by a gunman who opened fire at him while he was driving from his house on Northwest 10th Way in Greater Portmore, St. Catherine. The gunman is believed to have waylaid him. The incident occurred in the presence of other family members who were traveling with him. As he came under gunfire, Lewis lost control of the motor car he was driving, which veered off the roadway and onto a sidewalk, coming to a halt in a clump of small trees meters away from his home. Church members have expressed shock at the incident. After the shooting, frantic church members pulled up one after the other at his home as panic spread with news that their pastor had been shot. One congregant said that she last saw Louis on Sunday night at a family get-together at church. This incident sent me pressure way up. This just come as a shock. We are praying for a testimony instead of death. A testimony to say, I have been through this and I'm still here. She said, startled residents came out of their homes to examine the bloody scene, trying to piece together what had transpired. People are watching man him no know, one resident said. Looking at the crash scene, another surmised that Louis was shot while reversing from his driveway onto the roadway as he normally would. A community leader said that he was surprised at the attack. Me and the man move so good and to see what happened right now, I know me shock to see a man of this caliber. I know that is a man that don't mix up, the resident said. He's my pastor. Last time I saw him was last night. He took me by surprise. That man don't even talk, one church member said, as anxious congregants gathered near the blood so car and roadway waiting for further news. We don't get any information to say he's stable or not stable. The last thing we heard was that he was being treated and placed on drip, one male church member said. The Greater Portmore Criminal Investigation Branch is investigating the shooting you have a blessed day today you have a prayerful day today you have a day of victory today because we are praying to our father which art in heaven god bless you and have a wonderful god bless spirit filled deliverance day today forgive even as god forgives you in jesus name you take care jbn we keep you informed Please remember to subscribe, like, share, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items.